Hi everyone, in this video we're going to go over a really, really good book on differential equations. The book is called Ordinary Differential Equations with Applications, and it's written by Larry Andrews. So this is the Andrews book on Ordinary Differential Equations. Larry Andrews was a professor at the University of Central Florida. That's actually where I went to school as an undergraduate. So I actually got my bachelor's there years ago as an undergraduate student. And I never actually got to meet Andrews, but this book is awesome and it is completely written for beginners. It is really, really great. Let's take a look inside this book. Ordinary Differential Equations with Applications, Larry C. Andrews, University of Central Florida. So maybe you haven't heard of, you know, UCF, but it's pretty cool because, you know, I did get my bachelor's from there a long time ago. So it's kind of cool that I have a book uh, written by someone who used to teach there. And it looks like Mr. Andrews taught there a long time ago. So 1982 is when this book was printed. Maybe this is the first printing. So this is the table of contents, and I'll be honest, I was really, really excited when I looked at the table of contents because this really goes along well with what I actually teach in my differential equations class. And I have a lot of really good stuff to say about this book, so let's just keep going. So basic concepts, all the really, really important definitions that you're supposed to know, all the standard stuff you learn in a DE course, very standard. That means that if you buy this book, it will go along extremely well with what you're learning in your college classes now. This is where Andrews does a little bit of extra stuff. He has a whole section on applications. Then he goes into linear equations of higher order. And what do we have here? Applications involving initial value problems. Yep. Really good stuff. Then he goes on to Laplace transforms. All the usual stuff. Really consistent with what's done at most schools. And then systems of equations. Finally, we get to numerical methods, and then he finishes with the power series method. I think that's actually kind of interesting. Um, the book I use to teach does not end with power series, but when I teach the class, that is the last subject I do. So I guess uh, Dr. Andrews also uh, agreed by my method, which makes it kind of cool. And of course, he has answers to the odd numbered problems, which makes it really beneficial when you're using this for self-study. The biggest pro of this book is that it's written for beginners and it will go along well with whatever book you're using for your class in college. So if you're taking a differential equations class and you buy this book uh, right now, and you can probably get it for less than $10, it will help you. It'll have examples similar to the ones that you're doing in class. Maybe some of the questions in this book will show up on your tests. Plus, you have answers in the back of the book to all the odd number problems. So this book really complements a college course well, and it reads pretty much like most of the other DE books do, although I think it's written at a little bit of a more uh, elementary level. I feel like Mr. Andrews took the time to uh, really make this a, a good book. Now, no math book is perfect. This is the section on variation of parameters. And again, this is just my opinion, but I don't like how uh, Dr. Andrews presents the uh, variation of parameters technique. I like to do it a little bit differently when I teach it uh, with the determinants. It's just easier to memorize uh, it the way I teach it, I think, uh, than this. But again, I'm just nitpicking. Uh, many books do teach things this way. So overall, this is a really, really good book. This is the section on series solutions. And in this section, I feel that Andrews does a better job than other books. Uh, the amount of detail that he shows in his solutions are extremely beneficial uh, for students who are learning infinite series solutions. Learning series solutions is really hard. And it doesn't matter how good the book is. It doesn't matter if the whole solution is in front of you. It's still really hard. So. Having Andrews present pretty much everything for you uh, makes it a lot easier. So he does a really good job with the series solutions. This is the section on the method of undetermined coefficients. Uh, this is the part where Andrews is trying to explain to the reader how to guess the particular form, the form of the particular solution rather, y sub p. This is really hard to put into a book. Um, I usually do a bunch of examples in class when I teach this. 
And he has made a table here, which is pretty good. I mean, it's better than no table. So uh, my hat goes off to, to Mr. Andrews for providing this table, which really helps people, I think. Overall, I think this is an amazing book. Uh, I'm really surprised with how good it is. Uh, it's not that I expected it to be bad, but uh, it's just I'm surprised more schools aren't using this. I'm surprised this book isn't more popular. Uh, I feel like I've found a diamond in the rough here. This is a really, really good beginner book on differential equations. Again, it's ordinary differential equations with applications, and it is the Andrews book. Uh, Mr. Andrews also has a book on partial differential equations, and I will try to do a review of that in the future. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to like, share, and of course, subscribe if you're not already a subscriber. And if you really want to help out, consider becoming a member of the channel. Until next time, take care.